Why? Hello and welcome everybody. It is Pox again. Don't mind the hair. I just uh, kind of afro combed everything out. And by the way, Mr. Mini K would like to say hello to everybody today. Isn't that right, Mr. Mini K? He's kind of he's kind of half asleep. Don't really mind him. So today I wanted to go ahead and talk to you guys about something kind of interesting that I'm doing for you guys. Um, so if you guys are familiar with what I did last league, uh, I'm kind of going to go ahead and help you guys out and direct you with my league starters for this league. So. I don't have any full-on guides posted for you guys yet, um, so I wanna let you guys know what I'm currently doing. So I have currently here tallied a couple of builds that I would like to play and or league start with. Um, now, not to mention that these are also gonna be builds that you guys can use. So I want like kind of your advice at how you would like for me to format this because I'm, I am going to make a YouTube video uh, for probably at least half of these characters. Um, like kind of directing you guys and helping you guys out with the whole like league starting etc so currently what I have set up is um, in this document if you guys don't know I'm actually really bad at Google spreadsheets I've literally never used them so we've got the build templates edit as needed link specifically just because you know it's not possible for me to tell you what the best way to play your character is since we don't really know like all of the new stuff essentially so take you know links and stuff with a grain of salt um, so basically the first thing is we've got the builds so we've got winter for example winter orb elementalist uh, bandits are gonna be kill all it's not a crit build there's a link to the skill tree it explains the defensive mechanic of it along with the keystones that we take it explains the ascendancy order the auras that you would use the curses which pretty much are a blasphemy and then the links now, um, there is going to be, for example, like I do plan on adding like the whole uh, what skill should I level with in here. Uh, that's just going to take a bit more time. And then there's going to be like maybe it's hard to say mandatory uniques, but like, for example, for Righteous Fire that I have on here, Righteous Fire, I could kind of do like mandatory uniques since uh, I'm more educated with this skill. Um, but let me know like kind of how like what other categories you would like for me to add for you guys, since this is all 100 percent for you guys. Uh, I want to have all of this content, at least, like I said, half of the builds posted for you guys beforehand. Uh, I can tell you the ones for sure I'm going to be comfortable with. This Arctic Breath is probably going to be Arctic Breath slash Cold Snap, Occultist. Um, this character I'm really happy with for sure. I'm making a video guide for this one. Winter Orb, I'm not too sure. I'm probably still going to make a video guide for the character. Um, Essence Drain, I really want to play Essence Drain, mainly because this tree is nearly identical to... Uh, Death's Oath for the most part. Um, if you guys don't know, there was a huge buff to damage over time, which includes Essence Strain and Death's Oath. Stormbrand is actually so far winning my uh, uh, my actual uh, league starter. So Stormbrand Hierophant is something that I'm super interested in. Lancing Steel Dead Eye, I'm not really too sure about this one because this is kind of more, you know, I don't really play much attack based builds. So uh, I can't really direct you guys too much with this character. So I can't promise if there's a video on it specifically. Righteous Fire Trickster, you will see, and Blade Vortex Chieftain. Uh, this one's kind of a, I wouldn't really call it unique necessarily, but it's another character that I'm pretty excited with, mainly because um, if you play a Chieftain, you get all fire based. Uh, since we'll be playing like SSF slash Private League, can easily get Tabula Rasa's Valdem, get plus two AoE and or duration. You pretty much have like a solid chess piece to use for all the way throughout the game. Um, since with our previous league, we played Shockwave Totem with plus two uh, duration and we were killing Shaper Deathless with Shockwave Totem, so that's pretty nice. Um, so one other thing I'm gonna do as well is with the links, since I don't know if you guys know or not, I don't use Path of Building, I don't really like it, but for you guys, uh, I do something a little special, uh, you know, because I love you guys. I do have a leveling tree that I'm gonna post with all of them, uh, and that'll be linked here. So currently, this is just a PoE URL which brings up the tree. Um, just so people can start using the template immediately. You can see there's already like some people in here You can't really see but you can see them over here What I am gonna be doing for you guys more specifically with each build is doing a breakdown uh, So for example in path of building here You can see I have if I were to go to manage trees the breakdown of two four six eight etc And with this one specifically uh, I even have a CI respec in here since naturally you're not gonna be leveling up as CI Especially if you're playing like hardcore or something Soft core, it's totally understandable, but in hardcore, you don't really want to do that, especially if you're not experienced. I know a lot of people are going to tell me this right now, and I'm going to let you know, sorry, I don't really feel like doing that. I'm not interested in using Path of Building with doing all of this other stuff because 
I'm sorry, but that's just not me. There's a lot of, a lot of other content creators you can go to if you want that. Um, but just simply put, I don't have fun with it. I don't really enjoy it. The only time I really use this program, which is so rare, is if say I have like a level 97 character or 98 character, I'm trying to find my gear upgrades at that point. I'm trying to min max. Then simply put, for example, um, is this saved actually? Let me make sure that this is saved here. Save uh, winter orb. So a good example of how I use path of building is I would click back. I could click like my death's oath character. Uh, I can go to my gear, for example, and I can just kind of, I don't even know how to use this program. I already forgot, but I can like kind of look at my character at what I'm aiming with, but I don't like path of building for starting characters. I only like it for the existing characters that I want to improve because otherwise it spoils a lot of the fun for me. Uh, anyway, though, that's pretty much uh, going to be it. Like I said, let me know what you guys think. I'm going to try to put majority of these out tomorrow um, since Path of Exile's expansion is in one day, 18 hours. So basically, I've got two, two days to put out majority of this content. So anyway, that's pretty much about it. Just wanted to keep you guys up to date. Hope you guys had a wonderful time. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Remember, if you did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. And remember, you can catch me streaming live every day at twitch.tv slash box. Hope you guys had a wonderful time, and I'll see you boys all tomorrow. Nikkei, okay, you want to say goodbye? Come on, Nikkei, okay, say goodbye. Nikkei okay, doesn't want to say goodbye. I'm sorry, guys. We tried. <laughs> I'll go to everybody. <laughs>